Well, Sean, obviously you're leading up to uh, the Bermuda Day Half Marathon, but today is a test for you, mm -hmm. 10 miles. How did you think you adjusted to the conditions? Sun out, sun in the clouds? Right. So. Um, I didn't find it too difficult, to be honest. Like, um, I kind of adapt well to the heat, so the heat and me go together well. So um, <laughs> I felt comfortable, didn't feel troubled at all. Now, clearly you set a pace early in yes. the race. You wanted to establish yourself and see who came with you. Yeah. Um, but, but as you can tell, no one really went with you today. So running by yourself, yes. how difficult is it uh, I know you can train by yourself, but actually racing yes. by yourself, what's the difference? It takes a lot of mental concentration for sure, because it's easy to just kind of settle in, but um, I just make sure I kind of stay disciplined. I look at my watch really, 
and look at the times for the miles. So I set myself a target today to hit like in the low 530s each mile, so I was making sure I was sticking to that. Yeah. yeah. Now, one thing a lot of people look at is a distance. Yeah. But when you start adding Bermuda's inclines yeah. and so forth, yeah. it makes it that much more it challenging. Does. Um, how do you make sure that that you do stay on those courses of 5:30, but you've got that you got quite a few hills along yeah. the way? So I'm a strength-based runner, so like the hills, I'm usually pretty good at hitting the uphills hard. So mm. yeah, every time I hit an uphill, I, I go hard really, um, and from there I just kind of make sure I keep the pace honest coming off the hill, don't let off too much. All right, well congratulations. Thank you. I'll Appreciate see you later on. All right. Okay. Well done.